Put this on your fan, and you'll never use air conditioning again. That's right, folks, and the tip is very simple. You'll need two plastic bottles. First, with the help of an object, you'll cut off the top. So first you make a hole, and then you cut it off because we only need the top part. Now you've done that, take a sponge and a little bit of soap and scrub very well parts of the bottle to get rid of any leftover product or any dirt. Now we're going to need a styrofoam box, okay? A thermal box and also two pieces of this plastic pipe. Oh, plastic pipe. It's very easy to find. You can find it in a building materials store. You'll take the styrofoam box and we'll make two marks on it. You can take the tube itself and make a mark on this side and also on the other. And then, oh, you can use a stylus or a pair of scissors to cut it out. We're going to do this so that to be able to pass the tube through. That's why you're going to do it on both sides. Next, guys, we're going to take the pieces we've cut again, and now you're going to join them to the tube. You're going to take a piece on the tube. You can put some insulating tape on it to make it stick, and you'll do the same thing with another piece. It'll look like this. One piece with the bottle and one without. That done, now you're going to take your fan, and we're going to take, take one of the pieces and we'll position it on the front underneath the fan. And to help secure it, just use this plastic clamp. Make two small holes in the bottle, and you can attach it to your fan. Then you can cut off the excess clamp, and it will look like this. As for the other part, we're going to put it behind the fan, but now at the top, okay? You're going to take the other piece and position it and do the same process and attach it to this part. And look, guys, it's going to be like this. One attached to the front and the other attached to the back. Now you're going to take the styrofoam box again with the two little holes there, and you're simply going to put the plastic tube through it. Pass it through this side first, and then pass the other piece through that side. And to finish off, everyone, now just get some ice, okay? Ice cubes. And you're going to put them inside the styrofoam box. You can put a good amount in there. And then, guys, just cover the styrofoam box and our homemade air conditioner is ready. How does it work? When you turn on your fan, it blows hot air through the ice and returns as cold air. Come back as cold air. It comes out at the top. And it's really nice. It's been helping me a lot here at home in the heat we've been having because the fan alone wasn't doing the trick. So I decided to find out how we can actually make a homemade air conditioner that really works. And this one really works, folks. As soon as you turn it on, the air starts to feel cold, and as time goes by, it gets even colder. It's really cool. Do it at home, and you'll be sure to like the result.